It is what artists have waited nearly two weeks to hear. The winners of Art Prize are now out, and the prizes range from two grand all the way up to $50,000. A big night in Grand Rapids as Art Prize gets ready to wrap up. The official closing celebration held Friday night at the atrium at Uccello's. The viewing party gave people the chance to meet and greet the winners, and here they are. Brian Whitfield's Planted by the Sacred Streams of Grace, a winner in the Contemporary Black Art Award. He will get $2,000. Elia Taj's shopping list also won in that category for another two grand. There were also two winners for the Asian Art Award. Paper Cinderella by Michael Overholtz, and Before You Go, a submission from Christian Reichel and Monica Pritchard. Both win two grand. $2,000 also goes to Guardian of Sacred Space for the Artista Latino Award. Russell Cooper also wins two grand in that same category for the 20th of January, Lunar Eclipse over Grand Rapids. For the 2D Jury Award, TJ Lick is runner-up with Ask the Animals and They Will. That earned the submission $2,500. And the winner for a $10,000 prize was Aging Out, 18 years old, highlighting challenges that kids face when they leave the foster care system. In the 3D Jury Award category, runner-up Sword in the Sphinx earned $2,500. And Holly Ross's Soaked came out on top with the $10,000 prize, a ceramic piece mimicking a wet cardboard box. For the installation juried award, again, Ileataja's shopping list was the runner-up, bringing in $2,500. Ten grand was given to Project Unity, 10 miles of track in one day. A video projection of Chinese immigrants memorializing those silent workers who laid railroad tracks in Utah. For the time-based jury award, In My Dreams We Levitate was the runner-up, earning $2,500. Stephen Smith's Art Pod won the category, bringing in ten grand. He turned an old shipping container into a micro-gallery with multiple installations. Jimmy Cobb's Lakeshore Drive was the big design and drive winner. His aquatic landscape painted on this car got him two years of a Honda lease. And the big $50,000 grand prize this year goes to Christian Reichel and Monica Pritchard for their submission before you go. The audio-based installation compiled a series of interviews from people around Grand Rapids in the country. People could listen to their recordings in a phone booth, covering a wide range of topics from life and death, hopes and dreams, even regrets. We caught up with the big winners after the announcement who say the idea came about two years ago. My mom had been working at a, at a law firm and they did a lot of estate planning, working with older clients, um, and we were also going through a, a death of our, one of our family members. And so we wanted to encourage, figure out a way that we can encourage people to tell stories, uh, empower people to tell stories, normal people, regular people, um, to tell their story and, and, and to encourage them to ask questions of you know, the people all around them, their loved ones. And, uh, and that's where it started from. So again, congratulations to all the winners and everyone who submitted artwork for this year's Art Prize. You can check out all the art this weekend because the event officially doesn't wrap up until Sunday. We've posted the full list of winners online at fox17online.com.